Welcome to the video tutorial on inferences on proportions in R. In this video tutorial, you'll learn how to make confidence intervals on a single proportion and a difference in proportion. All right, so the first thing we're going to need to know is the prop.test function. Now, in the code that I have over here, you'll see that I have prop.test. The first number, x, is the number of successes in our sample, and n is the actual sample size. I have an additional argument here called conf.level. That's the confidence level we want. In the first line, you'll notice that it has it specified, and in the second line, it doesn't. If you don't specify it, you get a confidence level of 0.95, or 95% confidence level. So, let's run this code and see what happens. Now, notice we got two outputs. The first one is for a 98% confidence interval, and the second one is for a 95% confidence interval. Now, notice that we have right here our 98% confidence interval. It specifically says that here is a 98% confidence interval, and our value goes from 0.29 to 0 0.36. And below it gives us a sample estimate of our sample proportion. Now below, we did exactly the same thing, except we let it go to its default, which is 0.95 as its confidence level or 95%, and we get 0.29 again and 0.35 this time. Now, suppose we want to do two proportions, or we have two proportions and two groups that we'd like to know if the proportion are difference between the two groups. Now, what we're going to use is the prop.test, except we're going to modify it by adding in this additional statement that has C, which means a column. And here we're going to put in, in the first entry is 553, and that shows the number of successes in our first population sample. This is the number of successes in our second sample that corresponds to our second population. Now, if we go over farther, the n again is the number of samples that we took in the first population, and then the number of samples we took in the second population. So, what we're going to do, want to do is run this code and see what our result is. And here we get a two-sample test on the difference in proportions. And specifically, we're interested in the confidence level or the confidence interval. So we have a 95% confidence interval that goes from negative 0 0.004 to 0 0.0818. Now, if you notice below, again, it produces sample estimates as well. All right, this has been the R video tutorial on inferences on proportions concerning confidence intervals. If you have any other questions, please ask or watch the next video.